and welcome back. This is Get Famous episode 26. So we're picking up pretty much right where we left off. Uh, Hero is looking after our new <laughs> little baby cloud, I believe. Um, but yeah, so oh, Hero doesn't look too good. Maybe she needs to take a pregnancy test. <laughs> we'll be doing that in a second. But first, I figured we should get our room ready for our little baby. Um, we might put him, um, maybe here, right next to his parents, I guess. I don't know, that makes sense to me. Uh, we're just gonna do that. We don't really need these, it was just to fill up the house, I suppose. Uh, so, let's see, we'll keep that there, that's fine. We might get a bit more of a, a green looking one. Because he's green, you know. <laughs> I <laughs> love that logic. I'm like, we want a green one because he's green. Oh, we'll do the void critter one because it's cute. Okay, love it. So, uh, let's just quickly decorate his room. I could have done this off camera, but let's be real. When do I do that sort of stuff? So, not today. So, ooh, I like that bed. That's nice. So, that weirded me out. I looked here. I'm like, why is there plants in his room? No, it's because they're in this room. I know what I'm doing, guys. It's okay. Don't even worry about it. Um, uh, we'll put that there. What else does he need? He'll need a potty jar. Yeah. He'll need a tablet because let's be real. Why would we look after our children? Let's get them a tablet. I don't know. Is that how you be a parent these days? I don't know. I'm sure some people do that, but I don't know. <clears throat> Although I totally don't blame them. I would do that. I... I don't really want kids because, like, I know that I probably wouldn't put them first. I would put myself first. So, I think that's kind of fair. But anyways, um, <laughs> I, I like myself a lot. Uh, but, you know, whatever, right? But, yeah, so we've got a dollhouse. we got, yep, I think we've got all we need. Let's decorate it a little bit so it doesn't look too bad. Um, we'll put a little tree there. Movies, groid critters there. Yeah, that looks nice. And then maybe uh, some bunnies. Uh, I don't like that. Maybe this. This is kind of cool. Yeah. <clears throat> and then, I don't know, maybe some... Yeah, let's do this guy. I like this guy. He's so cute. I love the little um, <clears throat> kulala bears. I think they're adorable. Like, I'll, I'll literally, I love them. Couldn't, can't get enough of them. Um, that's kind of cute. And then we'll get maybe this one. There we go. Super cute. And maybe some balloons. Do they fit anywhere? We'll put that there. Maybe above the void critters. I like that. I'm happy with that. That'll do. We should get him a rug though. Because, I don't know. I like rugs. Um, ooh. Let's get him the void critter rug. You can have that. Maybe he really likes void critters. Can I not put this here? Why can I not put this here? I think you will find you are wrong, and I can put this here. Look at that, I can. I told you I could. I don't know what that game was on about, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> there we go. That's cute. I love it. Okay. <clears throat> Actually, let's put down some more Get Famous stuff, because I think we've got some good, like, kids-style decorations and stuff that we can use here, so that's kind of fun. Let's do that. Because, like, it is the Get Famous Let's Play. Oh, look at that. We could put a sword in his room. Heck yeah. What kid doesn't want a sword in his room? I know I would like a sword in my room. Let's do the blue chicken one. That looks kind of cool. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think that's a little bit big for his room. <laughs> no, yeah, I think I'm just going to put this here. You're welcome. No, I'm joking, guys. <laughs> I'm joking. Don't worry about it. I'm going to put this here, though. Am I? Or am I not? No. I, I'm not going to do that to you guys. I'm going to put the rainbow down though. Because I like the rainbow. And I want to put down one of those. Um, if we go to kids. We don't want to get famous. We want, I want one of these. And I feel like a rainbow next to it. Is just a good choice. Don't you agree? You may not agree. But I think it's a top choice. Like look at that. Rainbow. What kid wouldn't want to play here? I would play here. <laughs> Let's put down a couple more kid things too, just while we're here. Because uh, I'm going to be honest, I'm pretty sure Hero's pregnant. I don't know, but I've just got a feeling she might be. So, 
that's kind of exciting. We'll put that there and let's just put down one of these because we're going to need one of them anyways. Anyways, uh, one of them anyways. I don't know. I don't know. We're going to need one of them soon anyways is probably more accurate. But there we go. Look at that. We got a little toddler room. That's so cute. So you can come here and potty train cloud. Oh, maybe you should get into some clothes first. How about you? Um, it's a fire, not some clothes. So you can change outfit. <clears throat> Why don't you put on, I don't know. I want to put her in some something that like looks comfy. Like she just had a baby. Why don't you get some pajamas on and go have a nap? Like, I feel like that's a good choice and you can deal with that. You didn't just push out a baby so you can potty train the kid. <laughs> there we go. So, hero, my sweet hero, I reckon she's gonna take a pregnancy test on her gold throne here. Do I have my sound on? I really hope I do. Yeah, I do. Oh, I've just turned it down. Whoopsies. That's okay. <gasps> oh, it's fine. I tried. Also, I think the patch has fixed this where level three celebrities walk like this. Oh, wow. She's definitely pregnant. Did you see that? As soon as she sat down, it's like pregnant. I didn't even get to do the suspense. Okay. So, this is Chadwick's baby. Um, <laughs> Chadwick is dating Judith Ward. Hero is not dating Chadwick. So, that's that's a thing. Also, I'm kind of sad. I haven't updated to get, like, the Moshimo hoodie. But I feel like that's a hoodie that Hero would wear. Like, she would wear the Moshimo clothes. I wouldn't. I, I Not out of, out of principle. I wouldn't. But, like, Hero would. So... Oh my goodness, are you seriously like wandering over here like that? You're so obnoxious. So Hero is probably going to freak out. So maybe you should have a bath. That's like a good choice. Why don't you take a nice, um, yeah, rose petal bath. That's uh, something Hero would do. So take some rose petal bath, relax, freak out, um, but try to calm down a bit. There we go. So Hero's freaking out. She's pregnant. She knows Chadwick is dating someone and she knows her brother's just had a baby as well. So she's like, oh my God, lots of babies. Ah. So that's, that's a thing. So what are we going to do? Who would Hero tell about this? Um, let's think. What would Hero do? What would Hero do in this situation? So why don't you come here and psych yourself up a bit? Maybe, um, can I like give myself a pep talk or something? I don't know. Um, maybe practice some acting. Yeah, get your head in the game. Practice your acting. Do that a little bit and just kind of zen out. Hero is not going to tell her brother. Not right away. I, I think he'd be angry. She's definitely not going to go tell Chadwick right away. I don't know. Will she even tell Chadwick or will she just break up with him? I kind of feel like she's just going to break up. Can I send a breakup text? Can I break up with him over the text? Are we even dating? Can you break up with someone over text message? Because I really want to. Do I have a laptop? Can you like, can I click on that and do something? Oh, good. My laptop's still out here. So can I like social? I just, I want to send him like a breakup email. I don't want to do it in person if I can avoid it. Chat with. Um, eesh, okay. So I guess we should text him. Um, do we want to invite him over? She wouldn't want him to come over, I don't think. Because like, you know... She would not want him over here, like, you know, because, like, she doesn't want him to know. So let's, um, oh, okay, we'll invite him, I guess, and we'll come down here. You go here, darling. Please don't do your stupid slow walk all the way down here, because you're going to kill me if you do. She is. She's doing a fancy slow walk. Is Chadwick here yet, or is he walking over? Um, oh, good. So hopefully he doesn't notice, but can I do mean breakup? Perfect. Break up with him, girl. She's like, I'm done. Can't do this. Get out of my life. She, I don't know if she's doing it out of panic or if she just doesn't like him 
or what, but she's definitely done with him. She's like, no, I can't handle this. Goodbye. Okay. Oh my goodness. And Thorn Bailey's here too. Okay. Great. Good choice. We didn't even put on a disguise. Oh God, look how pregnant she is. Okay. So I reckon she's probably like, I'm going out, Hugo, goodbye. And so she's broken up with him on the way out. We're going to go tell... I reckon she's going to go to Nadia. Uh, she's going to go to her mum in this situation. She doesn't know what to do. And I feel like that's a good choice. She's going to be like, mum, I've messed up. So I think Nadia's not here. Where's Nadia? Nadia's out at the club. Okay, but maybe she'll tell her dad, but... We'll try to bring Nadia here. Uh, yeah. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is intense. But yeah, I don't know. I reckon she'll tell her mum. I don't, I don't know if her parents would be mad. I reckon Newton would definitely be mad. He'd be like, what have you done here? But I reckon Nadia wouldn't be. So that's why she wants to tell Nadia. So, okay. Let's do, um, actions. Okay, great. Good. So let's maybe go. Let's go here. Let's let's go here together. I don't think Newton's in the room because I don't. Yeah, I'll get a job when I want to. Nadia, where are you going? Nadia, don't leave. Please don't leave. She needs you right now. <laughs> so friendly. Um. Uh, let's maybe just like. I don't know. What do we want to do? get to know let's just talk to her for a little bit and like have a bit of a chat maybe say mom you're looking great today the cat's like i know what you're up to do a deep conversation as long as newton doesn't come in here we'll be okay because it would be not great if he came in here at this point uh friendly more um can i do this Share big news. Oh, who'd got $4,000? Oh, is he going to walk in here? Oh, thank God. Okay, so she's kind of excited. Here is like, ooh, I don't know. I don't know. Okay, so, but Nadia seemed to take that fairly well. So, can I, like, ask for advice or something like that? Um, maybe joke about the old times. I don't know. I don't know. What would she do? I feel like she's told someone and I feel like she's, I don't know. I don't know what she's doing now. She probably, I reckon Nadia's going to tell someone, but I reckon Hero doesn't want to stay here. I reckon she's like, I being here is going to be like admitting defeat. I don't think she wants to stay here. I, I don't know where she wants to go, but she probably doesn't want to stay here. So we might get some food and we might bounce. We'll leave these guys doing their thing. They can just have a nice quiet time at New Year's at home and stuff. New Year's resolution? Yeah, get a boyfriend. <laughs> That's, oh, hero is a mess right now. My poor baby. Can I get some food here? Do you guys have any food I can eat? Great, I'm glad. Because I'm going to grab some. Oh, it's rotten. That's okay, I'll eat it anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Here I need some food, so that's fine. We'll be okay. Don't even worry about it. Oh my goodness. You got work? Do you really? Oh, sugar, we've got a gig today. Oh, wow, okay. Well, I obviously want to go to that. So... We'll leave Hero here. And we'll go over to Hugo. We'll leave him here. We'll leave he we'll leave Hero here. Go play the gig. And then we might go do something with Hero. Maybe, um, I don't know. Maybe she's just hanging out with Nadia. Processing the whole thing. She's dealing with that in her own way. She might go out and do something. Like with Winifred. And tell Winifred about what's going on. But for now, I think we'll just kind of let her process that. And like hang out with Nadia and hopefully not tell her dad because her dad would be like, oh my goodness, this is ridiculous. <laughs> Your son just had it. Like who, whose baby is it? And I think, I reckon once 
Hugo finds out, he's going to punch Chadwick. I reckon that's what's going to happen. He's going to be like, you got my sister pregnant. Prepare to die. Because, <laughs> you know, he doesn't like Chadwick. And he kind of, I bet you he would have had some kind of inclination that, oh, God, is Chadwick here? No, it's just the same Chadwick's hair. Chadwick's hair's here. He's not here. Oh, my goodness. Can you imagine if Chadwick was here? Oh, that would be such a thing. Oh, wow. So, I reckon what will happen is um, Nadia will end up telling him. He's like, you know, your sister's pregnant. And he's going to be like, it's that Chadwick. I've seen him around the place. And he'll storm over there and punch him. And Hero won't even know he's done that. That's what I'm thinking right now, but we'll see. <laughs> we will see. But yeah, I reckon they'll make cute babies together though. But I just don't want them to be together. I just feel like they're not compatible. And But I wanted babies, especially if they've announced that there'll be three new packs in the next six months. Because they've announced there's going to be an expansion pack, a game pack, and a stuff pack in the next three months. So we're going to be obviously changing generations to cloud and whoever hero has as a child they're going to be our next like heir that we'll be playing with and so i don't know i wanted to kind of get a bit of a move on and like you know get the whole like stuff going on i don't know that's just what i wanted to do i wanted to get on with the generation same hair but different color love it <laughs> what a cutie what a cutie I would appreciate it if he stopped walking like an idiot, though. But that's fine. That's okay. I'm also thinking we're going to promote them in, like, celebrity level-wise, like, soon. Ooh, post a Simstagram story. Yeah, you can do that. Um, There you go. Which one's your co-worker? Hard to tell. They're all kind of dressed up. Headline effects on. Ah, cool, this one. So, friendly, cheerful introduction. Ooh, that's interesting. Look over here. So, before we've had, like, pizza and stuff as, like, our food that we can take. But you can see here, it's, um, they've got, like, fancy food. That must be because we're getting up in the acting career, which is kind of cool, huh? I mean, I think it's cool. <clears throat> uh, friendly, ask about day, friendly. Can I rehearse scene? There we go. Perfect. Oh, my boy. I can't believe Hero is actually pregnant. I had a feeling, like, that she might be, but I kind of thought that she wouldn't, you know? Like, it's like, surely she's not pregnant. If she wasn't pregnant, I was just going to let her be not pregnant and, like, still break up with Chadwick. But, you know, I think, I think it'll be interesting. Uh, we'll turn these off again because, like, <clears throat> I don't know. <laughs> we don't... Can you not drink on the job? I know it's New Year's Eve, but can you wait till you're done filming? Thank you. Um, where's the get to know? There we go. Get to know. Um, so let's go talk to the director now. Maybe friendly, cheerful introduction. Go introduce yourself. Say hello, get some notes from him, and then we'll perform. We haven't actually performed this one before, so I'm quite excited. I don't know if I've even performed this one, like, because I've done some, I've done some, like, of the acting gigs off camera because I have played through this and got to, like, level five celebrity and stuff like that. But, um, you know, <clears throat> we will see. We shall see. I really like this set, though. It looks quite cute. I don't know. I like, um... These kind of movies are like my jam. I do love a good period drama like Downton Abbey and stuff like that. I, I don't know. I'm a sucker for them. I told you I'm ready. Let's go. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's do our risky flirting scene. Ooh, this is intense. I wonder how Lee feels because I think this is the first time we've like done flirting like on camera. Interesting. That's an interesting dynamic. His son's born, and then he goes out and flirts with a girl on set. That I don't know how Leaf would feel about that. This is all very dramatic right now. I'm feeling very bold in the beautiful style at the moment. <laughs> oh, we'll see. We'll see. Oh, there's a kiss scene. Oh my goodness. That's wild. I don't... 
I don't know how Leaf's going to feel about this. I reckon she's going to be quite jealous, if I'm being honest. Um, I don't know. Have we kissed anyone before on set? I don't think we have. Yeah, interesting. I wonder. I wonder how Leaf's going to feel about that. Let's go shout at these people. Oh, you shouldn't shout at, like, a nice lady here. She looks like a nice girl. Oh, well. <laughs> yeah, I like that he's, like, giving her a little bit of a pep talk. I like that the flowers are foiling. Like, I think they look great. Uh, risky have drink. Ooh, there's a risky sword fight. Heck yeah. So, what I'm seeing is they got drunk, they had a bit of a, a fighting competition, and that turned into a sword fight. And then he won the gal. <laughs> He's like, yes, yes, we did good, and then, no, yes. Oh, that's good. Uh, let's do our sword fight for next, because I feel like that's much more interesting than a hug. But whatever. Maybe we should do the sword fight last, because it's more interesting, but we'll see. Also, why does it always look like he's, like, got an umbrella in his hand? I don't understand, but that's fine. Whatever, right? Whatever. Ooh, I love the sword fights in this. They're so fun. Heck yeah. Do a risky hug. Risky hug, risky hug. I reckon after this we'll go out with Hero. We'll head out to the the vampire bar and hang out with Winifred there. Oh, look at that. That's so cute. It's kind of sad though that it's not with Leaf. Hurts my feelings, my poor baby. Heck yeah. That's the gig over though. We're done. Finito. Good job, though. That's so exciting. Also, we're almost level 9 of this career, which is pretty awesome. Uh, go home, please. <clears throat> and we got paid $7,000. It was 7.9. That's almost $8,000. This gig's, like, this is pretty good for money. Although, when you think about it... It was like three days before we could do the gig. So that's kind of interesting. So we'll see. Um, ooh, we got promoted. We're level nine now. <gasps> Heck yeah. Let's choose a new gig. Although I feel like we should also choose a new gig for Hero. But that's okay. We're doing fine. Um, uh, I'm going to give these guys resolutions as well. Um, just before we head out. Make resolution... Raise a skill. We'll cheat those. <laughs> uh, make resolution. What do you want? Uh, you can maybe... Um, I don't know. You can raise a skill as well. Good choice. What do you want to do with Chadwick? Get to know him. Interesting. And how are you doing? Oh, my poor baby. There you go. Problem solved. So, hero. Oh, God. She looks pregnant. Oh, my poor baby. Let's... Let's put on a disguise and head out with Winifred. But let's do that. I think that's what she'd want. Um, I, I don't think she'd want to hang out at home because, like, she's definitely, like, I don't know. I think she's definitely confused and unsure of what to do and who to talk to and how to deal with these things. So we'll see. We'll hang out with Winifred. Can I? Uh... Why is she not available for travel? Is she already here? Okay, whatever. That's fine. Maybe we'll just run into her here or we'll invite her here. Maybe it's because she's a vampire and we can't bring her out while it's like daytime. Although I didn't think that was like an issue, but we'll see. My goodness, it's a blizzard here. Is Winifred here? Winifred. She's not here. I don't see her. Dang it. I mean, it's snowing. I wish, like, um, could you order food? Maybe get some... What did I say? Oh, well, that's fine. Whatever. I've never actually seen Forgotten Hollow in the snow, which is something you'd probably imagine that like, you'd check out. 
Although it's a blizzard, so it's probably not a great time to be checking it out because you can't actually see anything, but that's okay. That looks pretty cool, though. Like, look at that. That's pretty nice. This place looks pretty spooky in the snow. Especially because it's nighttime. Well, getting nighttime. But yeah, that's very cool. I've never come here. I have to look at more of the places in the seasons. Because actually, have we come in here in winter? I think we might have. It might have been... No, we came here in autumn. Interesting. We definitely need to like step up our game. Check out more places in the seasons. But you know, that's okay. We tried. We tried. Um, everyone's freezing. Not great. Can I invite Winifred here now? Are you a paparazzi? Because I'm not here. Don't even worry about it. I'm. There's no famous person here. I'm in disguise. Can you stop talking to this person? Like, you know, that's not a hero thing to do. She would not talk to a random person. Um. Yeah. I wonder where Win Winifred is. She would just want to talk to Winifred. Is this Nadia? Nadia, what are you doing? Oh my god. Nadia, you better not be telling people about my my condition. Oh my goodness. This is intense. Could you go to the bathroom? I feel like... Oh my goodness. I don't know how to feel about this. Chadwick asked her on a date. Like... I reckon... At the moment, she's going to say no. She might say yes at another point in time. But right now, I reckon she probably didn't... Like, she saw it. Like, if he texted her about it. And she's like, no. Nah, ignoring that. Like, she wouldn't have even acknowledged that she got it. Like, she wouldn't even say no. She's just not going to respond. You know? I reckon that's more like something she would do. Um, is Winifred here? Can I bring Winifred here? I would like to hang out with Winifred. I would also like to stop walking like an idiot. Like, because this is driving me mad. Yay, she's coming over. Yay, we love Winifred. Actions. Oh, good, we're in a group. Okay. So... I reckon Rinderford's probably confused as to why Hero keeps on inviting her out. Because, like, she doesn't know too much about Hero. And Hero's kind of, like, weird. You know? So let's just see how this goes. Deep conversation. Maybe we should ask Winifred to live with us. What do you think? I reckon it could be fun. Also, I like that we're, like, hungry again. I suppose that's pregnancy for you. Um... Ooh, she's romantic. Hmm. Interesting. Very interesting. Non-committal. Oh, of course we're in love with the non-committal vampire. But I don't know. They could just become friends, you know. They don't have to be, like, dating. I don't know. They could be. But we'll see. I reckon they'll be good friends, though. Where are you going? I guess we should go watch this. That's fair. Fair call. Can you get off your bum and go watch this, please, darling? Thank you. Very much. Heck yeah. Oh, that's interesting. The two episodes I've recorded today, and actually for the two days in a row, it's been New Year's Eve and we've done the New Year's countdown, so that's kind of funny. I like that. Interesting. Here we go. Can I blow the horns or no? Oh, look how cute she is, though. I love her. She's super cute. I mean, I think she's cute, but you know, that's just me. <laughs> Yay! Heck yeah! Oh, look at that. They're hugging. Oh, I love that. That's so precious. I reckon she's going to tell. Um, can I tell her the big news? Share big news. How's her... What's her reaction? 
I'm really curious to see this. She's like, oh, dang, girl, that's not great. And she's like, yeah, I know. I know. Like, oh, dang. That's intense. But with that, though, guys, I think I'm going to end the episode. Uh, let me know how you feel about these two maybe getting together. Or maybe Winifred just moving in as one of Hero's close friends. I don't know. I feel like they've got an interesting relationship dynamic. Let me know. What do you think about us breaking up ch with Chadwick? Do you think we'll get back together with him? Do you think... Um, you know, what do you guys think? How do you think Newton's going to re... Oh, Hugo and Newton are going to react to Hero being pregnant. I think Newton will kind of be like, oh, I mean, you're kind of young and stuff, but... What do you think Hugo's going to do? I personally think he's going to punch Chadwick because the, I, it's Chadwick, right? So that's like what I'm thinking. I think Chadwick's in for a bruising. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, thank you all for watching. Let me know what you're thinking down below and I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.